What's with all these boxes? We got stuff. You got stuff? And we're unboxing. What? We're unboxing Just Price Vinyl Records. And, and they're, they're awesome. awesome. But we got to price them and unbox them. All right, let's see what we got. Yeah. Crack them open, right, Santa? Crack them open. Good to see you again, man. It's, it's been a while. Good to be back. That's right. I don't know what's in what or where or when. So you like got to go back, back, back to work again. <laughs> now, here, now, here's a very important question. When did we order these? Um, three months ago? Yeah, three months ago. So these are all from three months ago. We don't even remember what's on these in this order. So this is going to be very interesting. This is a different type of unboxing. Because we have no clue what's actually no in here. Clue. There you go with your trusty tool. That's right. Santa to the rescue. Lost aliens. What you got? You got a lot of weird. All right, all right. What are you hoping's in here, Santa? Zappa. Zappa? You're always hoping for Zappa. Mmm. That's true. I got a Zappa for you, but I don't know if the first couple. Uh... <laughs> yeah, did you see that record I yesterday? Last night's video. It's impressive to see something play. look like that. Yeah. yeah. All right, all right. They're definitely flowing with it. Where's the big mess, man? Normally we make a big mess. What are you doing? We're, we're not there yet. <sighs> but yes, these are definitely uh, back-ordered stuff. Yes. And pre-ordered stuff that, you know, came out during, during all this. <laughs> all right. Do you see anything you're excited about yet? Yes, I've seen Fiddler. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, I'm hoping for... I'm hoping for the new Pearl Jam. I know, that's what I'm, yeah, like. I'm right. hoping for, Pearl Jam. for it too. I know we ordered some, but who the heck knows? That, that's what I'm really hoping for. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What's in this big box? I think they might be pops. No. And we need more pops. More get pops. Away from me. <laughs> well, we've got bubbles. Uh, oh man, you know who we're missing our now. Our our official bubble popper. We'll leave him right there waiting for you. He'll be back soon enough. Not pops. Not pops. Not pops. Not pops. What is it? Turntable? Mm-hmm. Let's see. Might as well break it out. Oh, okay. You got the box. You can't not show it. We're gonna do we're gonna do a whole video based upon these. Probably tomorrow or the next day or something like that. But they're interesting. And these are going to be our cheaper turntables. Like extremely cheap basement oh, prices. That's cool. yeah. right. That's right. I didn't it was those. We've, never, we've never taken in suitcase turntables here. Ever. So we're pretty darn excited. And everybody's like, oh, they stink. But they're good starter turntables. Yeah. And that's what we needed here. Oh, get... Especially if we have it at the right price point. I have two slash pumpkin box set thingies. Nice. All right, look at her go. Is that a Boston picture disc? Yes. yes do -do 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 -do. Aliens. All right, we're getting through these like it's nothing. Man, it's going to be a short-lived video. Woo! <laughs> and the rocks. They slid. Get away. What you got in there? Oh, ah, you got the box of CDs. I got pop, and I got the crap and stuff. What you got? I got a mash one. All right, all right, you gotta break it all out and set it all up. What is that? I think that's all we were waiting for. I think so too. Yeah, when we're all done, we will show you what's in these exactly. So you'll be able to see. Bunch of CDs? Yeah, whole bunch. Oh, that is a big Nash box set. That's probably a special order for somebody. Yeah, that's why I'm assuming. You never know. Should I just leave these in here? Yeah, but you gotta show them. So move the air bubble and push them all back and then turn it towards, let me through, past your heaping mess of stuff. Hey, that's just how I roll. <laughs> nope, they don't go that way oh, either. Man. You will have to figure this out. Set them up and then you've still got one little box. This could be another turntable. Let's see what's in her last little box. What do you think it is? 
Uh, I think it is a single solitary. You know that guy from Seoul? Uh-huh. I think he's going to pop out of the box. I think it's a single <laughs> solitary pop. It is not a single solitary pop. It's it two. It is two. <laughs> Living on the edge. And I was yeah. like, wow, she's pretty. And then I realized. <laughs> wow. Wow. Which one are you talking about? Joe Perry or Steven Tyler? Steven's oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Living on the edge. Yeah, I just think that's a chick too. Hey, you know what he looks like? Corella Deville. <laughs> <laughs> what? Corella Deville. Come on. Yeah, but with the, I really thought it was lipstick. All right, not too bad, not too bad. You want to open up hers while she's fixing the CDs there? See what it is. It's probably a turntable because that's what the other one was. And then we have to place a huge order after. <gasps> oh, all right, all right. Now we got a bunch of these. We just brought out those boxes because we weren't sure what was in them. Mm -hmm. But we will, do an, we will do an unboxing. You know, it'll be pretty interesting. All right, are you ready for me with these CDs? Yes. Excellent. What you got? I have Queen. Uh... Furbalicious? Yes. I don't know. New York. <laughs> uh, King. King of Asgard. Slayer. Slayer. Uh, two Slayers. Ozzy. Testament. Eon. Cool. Uh-huh. Iris. All right. Some metal. <laughs> what was that one? Uh, uh, uh. Looks like a floppy disk. Uh. Floppy disk overdrive. I have no idea. Cool. There's two of them. Disaster. Uh, Curtis Blow. Ha 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 ha. Uh-huh. Yeah. Metal. <laughs> Queen. Bicycle. An Anter. Uh. Go ahead. Go ahead. Give, me, give this one your best shot. Go ahead. Septura. And they're going to be like, you're wrong. Sepultura. Yeah. Yeah. Ozzy. For Forever in Terror. Sounds about right. Fate's warning. Yeah. Blondie. Yay, Blondie! Woo! Woo! You made it! You made it! <laughs> all right, all right. Like half of now we have a fun game to play. Yeah. Who has the better side? And you didn't get to set it up. Nah. That's right. That's right. So we're going to move these carts out of my way. And, and you didn't have enough. <sighs> so I'll just push some over. All right, we ready? I'm my box sets. Yes. Now, you are the what side? Left. You're always the left side. Always Remember the left that. Side. Always the left. And you are the? I'm the right side because I'm always the right side because right is right. All right, so we're going to have to do a who has a better side. You can go first. Let's see what you got. We're just going to go slow. You don't have to go at the same time. Tai Cho. Uh-huh. The band. What band? The band. Who? The band. Okay. Mm -hmm. ABBA. <laughs> uh, Mac, Mac Miller. Miller. After the Burial. Stone Sour. He is legend. Aliens. <laughs> That's the coronavirus bat. Yep, sounds, sounds <laughs> good. <laughs> Pearl Jam. Is that the new nope. one? Nope. Oh, man. T Tame, Imp Tame Impala. Man, it's, all, it's my blue eye show. <laughs> oh, man, we should talk about the warehouse and what happened oh my with God, the blue stuff, freaking... Stuff went flying, literally. And none of it was touched, except I knocked over a stack, and it just, like, fell over. And all the rain today is the blue eye shadow's yeah. fault? Man, it's a crazy day. All right, let's keep it moving. <laughs> Casey Elephant, Five Seconds of Summer, My Chemical Romance... Uh huh. Yeah. Up adorn. My, uh -huh. my chemical romance. Kate Bush. Bob, Bob Marley. Bo Bonnie Ver. Bon Bonnie yep. All right, his new one. Faith No More. Wake Up Sunshine. All that remains, I believe that is. Okay. The weekend. American football. Misfits. My chemical romance. The head in the heart. All right. Here's Picture disc. disc. No. Raekwon. Yeah, him. The chef. No. Do -do 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 -do. What the heck? Yeah, I'm Keep it moving. Over today. <laughs> the cars. The cars. A perfect circle. Social distortion. F fandom. Andrew Jackson. Jihad. The Beatles. Pang at the disco. Shine down. Pantera. Uh, of Montreal. Yeah. Brand new. It's brand new? Brand new. What? Interesting. Uh, Safan Stevens. Fiddler. 
Oh, wa wa water parks. Sounds good to me. Yeah, no doubt. My... Well, under pressure. Why don't you turn it on the side? Man, I... man this is rough. Coldplay. Wow. <laughs> wow, we're a bunch of dum dums. I knew it. I just couldn't picture yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yes. Seven Dust and the Smashing Pumpkins. Holy cow! Really? We're this. We're this rusty. You guys got to remember, we've been out of work for three months. Three months. And this is the first time we're bringing in new records in three freaking months. So it's been a while, right? Yep. And you are the? Left side. All right. And you are the? I'm the right side. All right. And on the right side, we have Pearl Jam. Ooh, that's the new one. And another Pearl Jam. Nice. Why'd you get two ones? Why'd you get two? <laughs> Tom Petty, Boston. Do -do 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 -do. Picture disc. <laughs> Hailstorm, Circle Jerks, uh, White, stripes. White Stripes, Say Anything, Misfits, Kate Bush, Social Distortion, A Perfect Circle, Bob Marley, After the Burial, Pearl Jam, Cage the Elephant, My Chemical Romance, wow. After the Burial, Stone Sour, Ma Mac Miller, Pearl Jam, Pearl Jam, ABBA. What? Are you getting upset over here? Is that what's going on? We're like the same Yeah, so side. I was just thinking, I'm like, damn, we have the same Tycho, side, just in a different order. The band, No Doubt, Violent Femmes, Judas Priest. Tom Petty, Grateful Dead, sep, sep, is that? Seven, Dust. Seven, Dust. Seven Dust, Testament, He is Legend, wow. Boston, White Stripes, Hailstorm, yep. Smashing Pumpkins. <laughs> what a weird, weird freaking thing, right? I'm yeah. like, this is what we ordered? I swear we had this more was... different stuff than this. What? The thing about this is this was the back order. Okay. That's what this was. This was our three month year, a uh, three month old back order. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's right. All right. Top of the screen will be nice. Click a second vote for it. The left side. Or the right side. Or the wrong side. I don't know. Whoa! <laughs> Blew my freaking mind. All right. Let us know what you thought about this unboxing. Barely made a mess. Barely, yeah. You did pretty good. Yeah. And just think, we were open the whole time and nobody bothered us. Uh huh. Is that cool? Aliens. It's one of these things, man. It must be the blue eyeshadow. Yeah. Right. What is going on with this stuff, man? Oh, gosh. Don't ever wear blue eyeshadow, man. You don't want to know what happens. I wore enough blue eyeshadow. Yeah, you head. too. Yeah, don't I ever put know. the blue. You could use the gray, the <laughs> black, the, black. the orange. Purple. Purple. Don't forget purple. I like purple. Purple, mm. purple and silver. All right. <laughs> um, blue. <laughs> We're gonna think we're having a gang war in here. Man. This is fun. Be on call. Shots fall the that's right, that's right. It won't be fun to see somebody come through like that. Oh yeah, I missed a couple, didn't I? <laughs> Alright, I think we I think we got them all. What you got? Hey, just a few boxes. Nice. A little bit. That's good. Still kind of muggy out. Kind of Got to get rid of our garbage, our evidence. Oh, Not much today, though. Well, at least we broke them all down, yeah. and they'll be out of our lives forever. How's it feel to be back, Santa? It feels good. Yeah? It does. It really does. Did you miss this place a little bit? A lot. All right. You are officially double face masked. I know. Officially. I know. Do you want to play a game? Sure. You can't say no. Because you were double face masked. You can't see anything, can you? No. You please didn't see that? Please don't make me play spin the tail. I'm talking. All right. Get the bag. So... Rihanna and I went shopping today. Okay. In a certain store in the mall. Okay. All right? Okay. And we got you something. You have to guess what it is in order to keep it. Okay. Do you think you are capable? There's three things I in this. I don't know because I always seem to fail at this. There's three things in this bag. Okay. We're going to hand you one. Okay. First, show it. Let me see it. All right. All right. What do you think this is? 
It's a lollipop. It's the lollipop. Wow. Right? Wow, you so weren't supposed to get that that quickly. Well, it's got the stick and it's got the things in it. It's it's the lollipop. Wow, you just ruined the whole joke. Oh, did I Joke's know? on me. I'm oh, sorry. It's because she's a mom. Mm, <laughs> yeah, she didn't think the worst. You know what it is? I should have handed it to her. If... Damn it! Ruined my joke. Double face mask. <laughs> So where do we go shopping? Boss Bobs. And what do they have? Everything, actually. They have a second floor. Yeah, they have that too. We didn't know about the second floor. Did you know about the second floor in Boss Cops? I've never been on the second floor, but apparently you have. if you're a veteran, you go up to the second floor and they give you a little thing where you get 10 or 15% off. No, it's not what we're talking about at all. Okay. They was, all it's part of the sales floor. Okay. Yes, it's like 80% off up there. Okay. It's ridiculous. I'm hooked up for every single holiday. They have some of the stupidest things I've ever seen up there. Not hate not. Everyone's hooked up for holidays now. That's like, right. Like like stupid funny. You mean, yeah. Right? It's full of funny things. They had a groundhog. Yes, they did. They had, they had hand warmers. They were the shape of pigs. Yes. <laughs> yes. We totally were going to get you that, but instead we went with the lollipop. That you were supposed to think was something else. <laughs> oh, man, we butchered that joke bad. Yeah. Man. I don't know why you had to be that first. I don't know, man. I don't know. But shout out to Boss Cops with my backwards bag. No. Yeah. They freaking rock. Yeah. Seriously. Great department store. And so we're on our way back from Boss Cops, and we happen to look out the door. Uh-huh. And our door. And everything must go. <laughs> Schuylkill Valley is officially closing why is it when we move in there's always a freaking store moving out can somebody please explain this to me i mean we were in the, we were in the phillipsburg mall and i'm moving in and everybody's like oh are you moving out too because everybody was moving out you know what it is what nobody has as much fun as we do is that what it is they're jealous nobody has as much fun as we do i'll go along with that what yeah, yeah. but before they opened um i think it was tuesday I heard them in there, like, giving themselves a round of applause. So I was like, oh, good, they're, they're getting ready, they're gearing up, it's going to be great. And now they're closing. And now that. Wah, wah, wah. So get your Schuylkill Valley on while you can because yeah. everything's going to be on sale and hasta la pasta, people. I got the perfect record for us to review. The new Pearl Jam. What do you think it's going to sound like? Hoping. Yeah? What do you think? I think it's done alright. Hmm. How about you? Uh, I don't know. Why don't you open it and show everybody what the records look like, the sleeve, the whole nine yards. Okay. Do you think we should give him a chance to win it? Yeah. Should we hold the contest? I think so. Yeah? Yeah, I think it's a good idea. What about you? Yeah, I think that'd be a good idea. Alright, alright. Everybody can enter. We'll ship worldwide. Right? And all they have to do is guess. Okay, what are they guessing? They have to guess. How many soundtracks are in this entire case? Let us know down in the comments. Yeah. 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 How many records do you think are in there? Just under 500. What about you? Close to 400. What about you? That's not a real number. You got to pick a real number, I like 351. Number 351? Uh, 401. 462. All right. All right. Good guesses. All good guesses. Let us know down in the comments. Okay. One guess per person. You cheat, you're out of it. Can, can I do it? <laughs> no, our you cannot participate. Count. You're the yeah. counter. Our guesses don't count. Yes, yes. No swimming around employees can guess this. Man. Uh, uh. We'll ship it worldwide, but you got to get it dead on the money. Mm -hmm. And you get one guess per person. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Do you want to see it? Yeah, let's see what you okay. got. Because see, it feels kind of weird. It feels almost like plastic mm -hmm. instead of cardboard. And it's real, like, difficult. Well, it's because it's brand new and shiny. Getting, in, getting it out. Oh, nice oh it's not sleeve. colored. Nice but look sleeve. how shiny it is. All right. Whew. All right. 
Then we're going to do a review on it. Mm -hmm. So stay tuned. Is there a gatefold? There is a gatefold. Let's see what it's working with. Ooh. Oh. Very nice. Mm -hmm. And there's a shiny book. Nice. Very nice. And if you win, you get this exact copy. Mm -hmm. We're going to listen to it one time. Do you think somebody's going to win? I hope someone wins. I think it's a really exciting contest. I only get one answer per account. Yep. And I don't care if you put it twice on there, you're disqualified. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. 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 All right. What's the back cover look like? All right. Very cool. I'm pretty excited to listen to it, you know, but... The edge of a glacier? Yeah. Yeah, because it probably weighs a gigaton. Ah. That glacier probably weighs a gigaton. Nice. <laughs> All right. All right, we got a record to review. We do. We do. What is it? Gigaton by, by Pearl Jam. Even Flow. No, it's not Even Flow. No? No. Oh. No, but we have a contest, too. Do we? We do. We're giving something away? Yeah, we are. This. This. This, this album. This one. This copy right here. The one, one we listened to. Yes, twice. 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 Scissor gang. Scissor gang. What? Twice. All right, yellow bandana gang. Yeah, yeah, You're like the yellow gang. bananas. <laughs> what? I've only seen two of the people with the yellow bandana, and they are part of my crew. Gangsters. Yeah. All right, so what's this contest I've been hearing about? They have to guess exactly how many records are in our soundtrack section. The soundtrack section. The bin. The whole bin, top and bottom. The exact number. Yes. The exact number. Exact. Not, not the closest without going over. This is not the price is right. The exact number. And how long do they have? They have one guess. One guess. Per person. Per person. YouTube account. Yep. One guess per YouTube account on our YouTube channel. Or you get disqualified. Or you get disqualified. And they have to put that guess in by 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Which, Which is, is the 19th of June. June 19th. Nine! Nine! Teen. Teen. Huh? <laughs> all right, all right. So what'd you think of this? Gigaton. Gigaton? Well, it's heavy. All right. Okay. How many records is it? It's it's two. But one side's blank. <laughs> yeah. It's, so it's three sides. Yeah, it's, it's only three, three sides. Yeah, it's three sides. Aliens. Hmm. I went to flip it. I almost killed it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. But she did not. She did not kill I it. I did. <laughs> all right. Um, so I, I guess I'm, I like Pearl Jam 10 and I like side B of the Unplugged album. And that's really about it for me with Pearl Jam. So I, this was not my favorite record ever. I really did enjoy seven o'clock. I thought seven o'clock was an excellent song. That was my favorite too. Okay. What was your favorite song? Never Destination I liked. Okay. All right. Was, was it a little faster? A little bit faster. A little bit more upbeat. Just, I found this a little bit slow for me. I'm not a Pearl Jam fan, per se, but I did like some of their stuff that they came out with on the album mm -hmm. you talked about on 10. Um, it was like it was missing the depth of sound. Yeah. It, it was very flat. They didn't enunciate enough either. It was very much just flat, I guess is how you'd say that. Well, Eddie Vedder's now flat. Yeah, it, it's <laughs> like the most... It, it was very thought-provoking music because you couldn't tell what exactly all the words that he was saying. <laughs> So, the book in the middle comes in very handy. Oh, yeah. Okay. Have you ever listened to Pearl Jam before? Yes. Pearl Jam 10, I did. I don't think there's anybody in the whole wide world that hasn't listened to Pearl Jam before. Yeah. I mean, really, they had that big of an influence mm -hmm. back in the 90s. But to be honest, I haven't listened to them probably since the 90s. So I don't yeah, really... ex except for the Unplugged album. Yeah, the yeah, Unplugged album will play that Great. all the time. Side 2, wonderful. Yeah, yep. the Unplugged was good. In all fairness, I did like their album, Backspacer. Okay. I did. It was okay. It wasn't the greatest album. You're not going to beat Pearl Jam 10. You're just, not, it's impossible. So I, I think that was the problem was that it wasn't Pearl Jam 10. Did you have high expectations? I did have high expectations. I was really super excited. Yeah, I was kind of too. Were you let down a little bit? I'm a little let down. All right. Did you have, did you have a least favorite song? River Cross. It was too slow. I couldn't understand a single word he was saying at all. And the word, and the name was River Cross? Yes. It was the last song on the, th on the third third side all right so it was the ending track mm -hmm. yes not good wow yeah. what about you did you have a song you didn't like <laughs> i liked seven o'clock wow that's all you liked that was all that's I how i feel it too honest. wow screw this whole that's, album that's all i liked <laughs>
Oh, oh, okay. Did you have a song? That's funny. I, I missed it. <laughs> he said, "He said that's because that's the time you get out today." Ah, I'm back here at seven o'clock. No, there you I, go. Seven. I did, so I closed really at seven. The song that I really liked, and the rest of them just didn't really do much for me. The one I didn't care for was um, was that that one? Uh, yeah, that know, dance, dance of the, the clairvoyance. Which sounded like a cool song, but yeah, that's what I was. I was like, that's a pretty cool title. I hope I really like it, and I didn't. Nah. Huh. So you're kind of feeling like this album was a letdown. Yeah, because I've, I've been waiting for this one for a little while, too. I was looking forward to this. And it was just, it was very mellow, and I think maybe it was too mellow. That's what I thought. And it just, I don't know if it was the mastering. It, it sounded very flat. It did not have mm. a enunciation is needed. <laughs> now, Santa. Yes. You're, you're a little bit of a different genre that, than us, mm -hmm. but you definitely like King Gizzard. Oh, yeah. you're, into, you're into some newer stuff. Lizzo. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, but but you are. You're into some newer stuff yeah. as well as all the old stuff. Yes, I can keep up with the music still. I haven't gotten that old yet. And you honestly say this one's just it not did, good. It didn't do it for me. No. All right. Would you buy it? No, probably not. Would you buy it? No. Would you buy it? Wow. And it's expensive too. Yeah, it, it's like forty. Is. Wow. Yeah, it's like thirty-eight, 38 something. 38, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. It's expensive. Yeah. And only three sides. Yes. It does. It does have a cool booklet. I didn't look at the fourth side. Nothing. No, there's there's a little something there, but it's nothing important. It's like this big. All right, now the all important one through ten, ten being the best, one being the worst. What would you grade this record? It could be on appearance, on everything, in a whole, in a nutshell. A five to a six. A five to a six. I can't give a solid one because it's five to six. All right. All right. I give it a four. I don't blame you. And, and I give it a four because the cover is really cool and it's got the awesome book and the album, the song titles are really good. But, but the songs the aren't? The songs. Yeah. I really only liked one song, but it's Pearl Jam, so I can't give them like a one. But I, I'd say a four. All right. All right. I give it a three. The only thing I actually liked about it was the way that the cover is. I think it looks awesome. Like Gigaton made sense with the way that the cover is, but besides that, I don't see how it related to any of the songs at all. Hmm. It's definitely heavy, though, which is where I can kind of see where that came from, but I, I personally wasn't a fan. All right. Well, I got some facts okay. on Pearl Jam yeah, and this yes. album. You guys need to squeeze together. And let's go over some facts first off. You know where this is going from the door. It's Pearl Jam. They're an American band formed in Seattle in 1990. Mm-hmm. Come on, right there alone. You got all the cred you need. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're going to get a four. You can't give these people a one because they were formed in Seattle in 1990. During the whole grunge phase, they were freaking Prime grunge. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Pro Jam broke into the mainstream with their debut album, 10, in 1991. Which was amazing. Was and on their freaking debut album. Amazing. It's one of the greatest albums, I, I would have to say, ever. I think ever. it was so great that it would be really hard for them to top it. And I think that's the only reason why you actually gave it a three, and yeah. you gave it a four, mm -hmm. and you even gave it a five to six, mm -hmm. because of 10. Mm -hmm. That album, 10, yeah. is a 10. It is a 10. It's an 11. It's, it's freaking epic. Mm -hmm. I grew up with it. I love it to death. I couldn't get down with this like that. But I'll get into that in a minute. You can't talk about Pearl Jam without mentioning the grunge movement of the early 90s. Mm -hmm. There's that fact. You knew that was coming. Guaranteed. By 2018, they have sold more than 85 million albums. Wow. Wow. That's yeah. Music. And Pearl Jam, here comes your favorite fun fact ever. What? what? When they get Ready? to the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. <laughs> Pro Jam was inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in 2017. Woo! All right. Now, Gigaton fact. Oh, wait a minute. I have one more Pro Jam fact. 11 studio albums and 20 live albums. Now, I think there's more than 20 live albums. I think there's a lot of boots. 20 live albums. It's a lot of even flow. Even flow. <laughs> All right. Now on to Gigaton facts. This is their 11th studio album, obviously. It was released March 27th of 2020. Obviously, right in the very beginning of quarantine. Mm -hmm. So everybody was looking for this thing, and you can only pretty much order it online because all the stores in the U.S. were shut the F down, including us. We just got it in now, even though we ordered it many, 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 many moons ago. Four months ago. Yeah, about four. 
This is their first studio album in seven years. I know, which was why I was so excited. Yeah, I think it would have been better. You ready? This is my last one. It's, in my opinion, this album has something for everybody, meaning old fans and new fans, but not everybody's going to love it. Nope. But it does have something for everybody. Seven o'clock. I'll go with that. See, like, even you found a song that, that you can actually appreciate, <laughs> and you, yeah. and you guys, you know, mixed and matched your answer. But that's my facts on Pearl Jam. There was no even flow type of song. No. There was no Jeremy. You know, I mean, everybody fell in love with Pearl Jam because of 10. Mm -hmm. That album is superior. It's epic. Even the music videos were epic. epic. But God forbid you mention Pearl Jam without mentioning Nirvana. Yeah. You know, in grunge. Because they were the epitome of grunge, Nirvana. But if you watch the old videos, you'll see everybody wearing their uh, flannel on. their flannels mm -hmm. and their their sideways, you know, head head moshing with their little shaking hair going down. I mean, that that's grunge, and epic grunge. I know, well, oh I know. <laughs> but it was even the vocals on this album weren't loud enough. Yeah, it, it was almost like the Coldplay performance at the Super Bowl. Where you just couldn't hear them. Yeah. That uh, was not the best one. You agree? Yeah. Yeah, it was. Yeah, I go along with that too. All right, so it's the recording engineer's fault. I really Let's agree. kick his freaking. I know. All right, we're going to do a little recap. Yeah, Caravan, we did, we did that review yesterday. This is some of the stuff that's still left in the new arrival box. You know, this way we have 10 tons of stuff. Did a bunch of new today. Did a review on Pearl Jam. Don't forget. A contest. Oh man. I hear that alarm going. Is the alarm going? <sighs> man. Ten tons of stuff. Remember how many's in here? Got until tomorrow morning. Dollar CDs, man. Ten tons of them. Dollar DVDs. Ten tons of them. Gotta go, gotta go, got to go. Huh? All right, all right, we're piling out. Shit. Shit. Do, 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 do. Oh, man. Oh, man, is an alarm going to go off, man? You better hurry. Shut that door quick. <laughs> Woo! You got to leave us a comment and let us know what your favorite record was. In that awesome unboxing, you got to give us a like, a big old thumbs up, because everybody likes a thumbs up, because when you do good, you get good, and then you have to... Subscribe! 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 <laughs> what? 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 You know what, man? Forget it. Forget it. Do you think they actually ring the bell? I don't know. I don't know. I heard something like 15% ring that bell. That's I looked it? at my analytics. Yeah, right? That's, That's it. it? Wow. We hit 6,000. Our group's over 1,000 on Facebook. Woo! Oh, nice. We're doing all right. I mean, come on. Better get out here and vote. I don't know for what, but vote. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Rock the vote. You remember that? On MTV, they used to have the whole rock the vote thing. That's right, yeah. <sighs> Now they're like, yeah, F that, man. We're just going to protest, yeah. bitches. <laughs> you know what this is? We have a few of tonight's Just Price Final Records, and we're unboxing them!